When Elder Legrand Richards, an apostle of an earlier generation, went to Europe on his first mission, a fellow missionary said to him, I met a man the other day who knows more about religion than I ever dreamed of. I told him that if he had something better to offer than what I had, I would join his church. This missionary expressed concern to Elder Richards that maybe he had said the wrong thing and made the wrong offer. Elder Richards responded, Elder, you told him just the right thing. If he has something better than you have, you should join his church. Does he have something better than a personal visitation of God the Father and His Son, Jesus Christ, in a pillar of light after centuries of spiritual darkness to open the dispensation of the fullness of times? Does he have something better than the coming of Moroni with the plates from which the Book of Mormon was translated? Does he have something better than the coming of John the Baptist with the Aaronic priesthood, the power and authority to baptize by immersion for the remission of sins? Does he have something better than the coming of Peter, James, and John, apostles of the Lord Jesus Christ with the holy Melchizedek priesthood? Does he have something better than the coming of Moses with the keys of the Latter-day Gathering of Israel? Does he have something better than the coming of Elijah to turn the heart of the children to the fathers in fulfillment of a prophecy in the book of Malachi? Does he have something better than holy temples and temple ordinances for the living and the dead? Does he have something better than the opportunity you have to take your sweetheart to a temple and be sealed to her for time and all eternity? Does he have something better than patriarchal blessings, something better than living apostles and prophets, something better than the great society of Zion? If he has something better than that, you should join his church. Brothers and sisters, this is truly a great and amazing church.